Do you want to shop? Ah, no. Thank you. Is this a human being or what? Does she think she's a cow? Who on this earth eats like this? Lord have mercy. What's up? No, no, no problem. I thought that much. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. Is it food you want to eat? Is it your business? How does it not consign me? Eh? You've been eating since now. At, at least, pity your heart. Eh? Pity your fragile heart. How does the way I eat consign you for this driving? It's my business. It's my business because eating like a gluten in the Bible is a sin. Since I carried you, you've eaten banana. You ate a family-sized loaf of bread. You ate um, what? The, you ate egg, ate granite. Use juice to wash it down, and now you want to eat rice on top of this one. That's bad now. At least pity yourself and your heart. It's not healthy. It's like it's like your head no collect. Eh? What? Eh? Why do you like putting mat for waiting another person business? It's, if it's to put mat in this one, yes, let me put <laughs> mat in it. <laughs> see me, see wahala. I just there, there, order for this uh, light to take me to where I'm going to. You just there, here, they put mat for my business. I don't understand. Stop eating this food now. Eh? If you don't stop eating this food, I won't take you to wherever it is you're going to. I won't take you. Stop. Madam, please, dude, holy, holy, take me to where I'm going to. I beg. Now, now, party day starts. I beg. Before I go miss my party, jollof. You are going to eat jollof. But this one is still the same rice now. Um, sister, please, just come down from my car. <laughs> come down, come down from the car. Mm -hmm. Story. Come down. You <laughs> don't jam. You won't collect, Abby. You won't collect. I say I'm not going again. Come and push me. I'm not going. Come down from my car Come now. Come and push me. Madam, you will take me to where I'm going to. You will take me to where I'm going to before I come down. I've already paid for it. Oh, yeah, madam. Please come down. I'm not coming down. Come down now. Madam, please take me to where I'm going to. There's no time. I say I don't want to carry you again. Is it by force? No, no, no. Eh? I want to reach where I'm going. I don't want to go again. Madam, please come down. You wound yourself because I'm not coming down to this counter. I reach where I'm going to. And I say I don't want to go again. That's eh? not our agreement. Our agreement is for you to take me to where I'm going to. Yeah, if it's your money, I can give you back your I don't need your money. Even though you add the money, I will not take it. I want to enter this vehicle and reach to where I'm going to. I say I don't want to go. <laughs> you never see this problem. Madam, <laughs> come down. Come down now. I'm not going anywhere. What kind of problem? Okay. No. Oh yes, I'm I'm very, very sorry. Eh? If I've offended you, sorry, J just come down. Mm -hmm. Eh, sorry, fine woman. Mm -hmm. mm? You can eat all the whole food you want, but just come down. I don't want to carry. Yes, so they don't church or church or church. You will carry somebody. Instead of you to take the person where you are, where the person is going to, you'll be talking, putting mad for person business. I, it's like something is speaking through you. Mm -hmm. It's something speak. Madam, come down. Heavenly Father, thank you for this day. I'm about to leave the walk this morning. I ask for your presence to come and go with me. 
I ask for favorable weather today. Father, let no child of sin and perdition cross my path today. I want money, but I don't want any money from any sinner. Lord, we are exalted and we respect your name by your name. Amen. Ah. Ah. You are set to go? Yes, sir. Okay. I I wanted to know, I don't know if you have spare money. I need some money. Um, Please. Okay, that's no problem. I'll, I'll send you the money. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you so much. You I don't have to it. thank me, honey. Hmm? We're in this together forever. All right? I just pray that God blesses me so that I can pay you back at least. Amen. What God cannot do does not exist. He will do it. Thank just you. Just so relax. Much. Thank you. I appreciate you. It's oh. okay. Thank good you. Luck. Good luck. Good luck. Thank uh, you. Let me open gate for you oh. and drive out. Monster, my baby. <laughs> mm? Lots of boy. Angel in flesh and blood. Mm? Mm. Mm. <laughs> Give it to that day. Oh. Huh? I know I'm naughty, but for you, I can be guilty forever. <laughs> <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> Babe. Are you okay? Hmm? What is the matter? Talk to me. What about the money you promised to give me today? Oh. Is that the reason you're frowning your face? Hey. Smile for me. Daddy got to you. Hmm? No, I got you. Have the money. <laughs> so take it. Thank you, your darling. You're welcome. Thank Anything you so for you. Mm. Mm. Give it to me again. Mm. Give it to me. Mm. Mm. Give, it to me. Mm. Give it to me again. It's mm. okay now. Mm. No. Yeah, uh, we, we, no. We, we, we. Hold on. Uh? Let me count the money first. Let me calm down. Hmm? Wait now. Uh -huh. Let me count. Um, uh -uh. Yeah. Lauren, stop. Lauren, stop it now. Mm -hmm. Stop, please. Wait, I'm sorry. I have to do this. I'm already up. Yes. I have to do this now. Huh? No, Lauren, I'm on my period. I don't get it. When did your period start? Last night. Oh, baby, but you told me you saw your period last month. Fault. Hmm? What is today's date? I don't get it too. You know, it's my period is irregular. You know, we have regular menstruations, so it's not regular. Probably due to stress or because I was sick some time ago. It happens. Uh, are you sure? Yes, don't worry. When I'm fine, we'll do it. Okay? So when did it start? Two days ago, you said? I just said last night. Hey, okay. okay, I won't touch here. I won't touch here. Let me use here and... No, 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 you cannot I'm, touch anywhere. I need, to, I, need to, I need to come down. No, 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 no. See, my lower hey. abdomen is paining me. I'm in pain. Hey. When I'm in my period, I get irritated easily. Hey. 
Be patient now, I'm not warning. But we know better, I've been giving you money now. You should consider me too. Okay, okay touch, me, touch me, touch me. Don't, I will not touch, touch anything. Me, touch me, touch me. Oh, honey, okay. you're back already. Yeah, welcome. Thank you. So, how was your day? Mm, as usual, mm. it was, it was. It was stressful, but at least I had many trips. How was your own day? Ah, babe, mm. you're a hardworking woman. <laughs> Thank you so much for all you do for me. Thank you, babe. Thank you. Babe, hmm? I don't understand what this world is turning into. What happened? Do you know the first trip I made today? Hmm. Two sinners, chronic sinners. Children are giving their Body, spirit, soul to the devil. <laughs> Baby, you know that uh, the world is not what you want it to be. Do you know that these little kids were behind me, kissing and touching? Mm -hmm. It's like they forgot that an adult like me was riding them. And when I tried to talk to them, pew, mm -hmm. their voices rose. Crazy world, crazy generation. Mm -hmm. The world is spoiled. Mm -hmm. Completely spoiled. Completely, nothing is left. Nothing left again. God will help them. Please just go and freshen up so you can come and eat. All right, I will be with you soon. Okay. God will help me now and let me be so stupid. God me. If I talk and pray and can know what, I use the rod. That's what the Bible said. Use the rod. Um, yeah, honey. Yeah? So, I was going to say, um, since you find it difficult getting a job, don't you think you should consider joining me in what I do? Hmm? Yeah. <laughs> Babe, stop now. Eh? I should join you in your taxi business. Yes, there's dignity in labor. I know, but um, no, no, please. Hmm? I cannot do it. No cut out for it. It's not that um, I'm degrading what you do, but please, I cannot do it. Babe, you don't even know why I'm suggesting this. I mean, you sit at home every day, depending on me for everything. And don't get me wrong, girl. Why I'm saying this is that you know how you men behave. I'm not complaining at all. I can continue to do it. But you know when it's when you start feeling like it's an insult for your wife to be giving you everything, that's just the only reason I'm suggesting this. I understand. I totally understand you. But uh, I should go and drive cab? No, no. No. I've been working before, you know it. It's just that I'm in between jobs now. Very soon I'll get a job. I've gone for interviews and they say they will get back to me. So I'm hopeful. Uh, let's wait on God. I cannot. The truth is that you're trying. I understand it. And I won't take it for granted. I promise you that. Well, it's okay. Just keep our fingers crossed and continue to believe God. After all, what God cannot do does not exist. Amen. Right. Yeah. Thank so, you so much, babe. It's fine. Thank it's you for fine. all you do. I was just, you know. I understand. Thank you for me. It's fine. Honey. Honey. Mm -hmm. Babe. You're backing me now. Yeah, you don't want to sleep? 
Mm-hmm. You don't want to sleep. I cannot sleep. Why? You have to try and make babies. Oh, we can we talk about this later, please? Talk I want to sleep. Talk about later. Hmm? Oh, oh babe. what? What is? For like one year now, we've been married. You're not thinking of us making babies. I just don't want us to make a huge mistake. A huge mistake. Honey, we're married. And it's expected of us to have babies. I know. I know. Okay, then. But economic wise, is a huge mistake. I'm not working, you know it. I don't have money. You're the only one working here. So if you get pregnant and eventually have babies, how do we cope? Are you saying you don't have faith that you get a job soon? It's not about faith here, babe. It's not about faith. I'm being realistic. If you if you get pregnant, uh, we will suffer. That's just the truth. Let's uh, talk about this. Maybe when I eventually succeeds and gets a job, then we make babies. I promise you that. Okay. Okay. Yeah. If you want, I can cuddle you. But who cuddle? Cuddle what? What am I? What's cuddle going to? Is cuddle going to get me pregnant? We we'll make babies, son. But let me get a job, please. You don't need cuddle? Hmm? I don't need cuddle. What do you then need? What do you need then? <laughs> I'm sorry, but... We'll make babies later. When I have a job. You're going to the airport. No, I'm going to East West Hotel. East West Hotel? Yes. Sorry. Sorry. So, um, Cecilia said airport. Oh. You're it's not... like my wife made a mistake. She's the one that broke it. Eh. Yes, yes. Okay. Oh. All right. Give me. Hello, baby. Uh, how are you? Yes, I'm on my way now to the hotel. Okay, okay. I'll be waiting. My wife? Forget about her. What does she know? Is he not staying there squandering my money and all that? Yeah. I'll be waiting for you. Just come. Let me enjoy my... <laughs> my food juicy. <laughs> okay, baby. Sir. Okay. This thing you're doing now is it good? Baby, hold on, please. I will call you back. What's that? Sir, so your wife books a ride for you to go to the airport. And you're going to the hotel to stay with another woman. Does it concern you? Does it concern me? Yes. It concerns me because I am a child of God and I will not allow sin to take its place where I am. Really? Yes. <laughs> Let me stop this car. Okay. Sir. What do you think you are doing? What I'm doing is I'm going to reverse this car now and I'm taking that. I will take you back you to your wife. That. I am taking you back to your wife now and right now. Oh, this is so thoughtful of you. Thank I love you. the gift. 
Wow, as if you read my mind. Oh, yes. This is so thoughtful of you. I love it. Cool. Anything for my baby. Mm -hmm. I know what you want, so I got it for you. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Mm. Mm. <laughs> baby, actually, I I appreciate this, but it would have been nicer if you complimented it with, with cash. Add money to it. Um, I don't really have much cash with me. Okay, so maybe next time, okay? You can do transfer now. Okay, okay. Anything for my my love. Anything for my baby. Mm. I'll do transfer. How much are you going to transfer? Um. Stop, stop, Lawrence. Babe, please, let's do this, okay? Can we do this now? Huh? Remember you promised me? You said the other day that um, next time we will do it. Can we do it now? <laughs> stop. We can't. Why? Ay, my head. My head is spinning me. Ah, everywhere. My stomach, everywhere is on fire. I'm not, I'm not feeling too well. I'm sick. Huh. When did it start? Since yesterday night. You know, all through last night, I vomited. I did not close my eyes, though. Oh, sorry. Hmm. Wait, wait, wait. How come you didn't observe me? I'm not observant, though. You didn't notice I'm sick. Is this the usual Serafina that you know? Eh? Normally, I'm the hyper one. I'm always everywhere. But I'm sick. I'm sluggish. What, babe? You should be very observant. That's how I will die now. You won't know. I'm sorry, but babe, you know, you, 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 you've been telling me that we'll do this, we'll do this, we'll do this. Every time you come up with one story or the other. And I'm a man. I need to do this. I have feelings. I know, but I'm sick. This thing you're requesting for now, do you want to do it with, with my sick body? Eh? If you do it, you won't enjoy it too because I'm sick. Hmm. See, let me tell you something. I'm very strong. Girl. You see, this thing you're requesting for, if I handle you, I'm well. This roof will fall down. You'll just be screaming. I will finish you. You will scream down this roof because I will handle you in a way you have never been handled before. Don't worry. Let me be well. I'm sick. You see me? You see this car? We are the body of Christ. We cannot be part of sin. And we cannot help you to sin. Eh? Look at you. Sir, so look, look. Take a look at yourself. See how you're sweating profusely. That is what sin does to you. Instead of you to have peace, live a righteous life and have peace. No, look at you, sir. Look at you. What is that your name again? Monica, sir. I will report you to your company. Well, sir, your wife is closer than mine. Closer than mine. Where are you going? You tell your wife, sir. You Please, will... can you go back? Well, yeah, just go inside, sir. Go inside. And I will also report you to the police. Police? Yes. Call police, sir. Call police. Sir, go inside. Go inside, sir. Just go inside. Eh? You don't want to go. Hello? Please, please, what is the problem? Go inside. Go inside. 
White House, Madam White House. What's the number again? No, number one, David. Number one, David. Go. You don't want to go inside. You think it's a joke? You think it's a joke? Go inside. Let your wife see you. Madam White House. Let her see you. You are back. From whatever business it is you're going for. What sin has done to this generation? No. I'm not doing this intentionally. Right? I love you so much. I would love to give you my body. It's just that right now I'm not feeling so well. I understand. Okay. Well, don't you think it's wise to go see a doctor? Uh, I have a doctor friend. I already called her. She said she will come over and treat me. Okay. But I would want you to take your health seriously. Please, right? Don't joke with your health. Health first. Thank you for understanding. It's fine. Look, you see this love? We'll consummate it very soon, okay? It's fine. My baby. Yeah. <laughs> what I say I insist you go see a doctor, please. Okay? Maybe you call your doctor friend and tell her that you'll be coming around. Okay. Let me call her. Thank you. Hello, doctor. Doctor, I would love to come over to your hospital for treatment instead of you coming here. I'll come right away. All right. You see? It's better. So, go change your clothes. I'll wait for you here because I'll walk you down the junction for you to get a cab. Then later in the day, I'll call to get the report. Thank you for understanding. You're such a darling. Come here. Oh. <laughs> Your lip is stained. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Okay. Yes, baby. Mm -hmm. Walk it out for me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm waiting for you, babe. Mm. <sighs> Lots is happening in this world. A man. A full fledged man like that. You left your wife in the house. You're going to airports. From airport is East Hotel. And you're calling somebody. Another woman. You want to stay and spend days with her. And taste. Taste immorality. I really don't know what this generation is turning into. The way it's looking, God is going to come soon, very, very soon, because the things I'm seeing is, is really appalling. Your wife booked a ride. In her mind now, you're going to the airport, you're going to somewhere. Now you are entering another woman. God forbid something happens to you. In your wife's mind, you've gone to the airport. Or you want to carry another lazy woman. And they said it's sad. Side cheek. It's all right. Heaven will help this generation. I can't use my right to take people to their place of destruction. It's not in me. It's not in me at all. Go <sighs> deliver their soul. Where is this other person? Um, hello, sorry. Are you are you Monica? Yes. Are you the person that booked? Um, Nelson. Yes, that's me. Sorry, move like this. Excuse me. Is there a problem? What is, what is all these things? Eh? You are going to Maraba. Yes. With my holy ride. 
No. Why? Is there a problem? Have you taken your time to look at yourself in the mirror? Eh? Look at you. Look at your fingers. Eh? Look at your hair. What are all these? Are you a herbalist? Madam, eh? what's that supposed to mean? God created you to be a man. And you're making hair. You even tie scarf. What, what are you people turning into? The word God created, you want to destroy it. Madam, are you here to insult me or you're here for your business? It can never be me. Insult can never come from me to any man created by God. But look at yourself now. Look at, take a very good look at yourself. What are you people turning this word into? You wear different things. You're tying scarf. God created you to be a man. You want to be a woman by force. Is that what it is? Eh? Madam, I don't blame you. Hmm? I don't blame you. I just say you know where. Mm. I'm just going to cancel this ride and get myself another don't ride. Don't stress yourself. I just canceled the ride. I can't carry you. Hmm? Have a wonderful day. Just look at God's creation. I don't blame you. Look at God's creation. I don't blame you. Look at you. How do you look? How do you look? May God have mercy on your soul. Look at this one. You're still confused if you're a herbalist or you're a normal person. Babe, why are you not talking to me? Is there a problem? There's no problem. I'm just... I just need to rest. I'm tired. Maybe you, you eat dinner then? No, I'm, I'm full. I'm very full. Are you sure all is well? Yeah, everything is fine. I'm just, I'm just very tired today. Kari, you don't want to lift. Let me just sing. You're avoiding my face? What's going on? Why is she not talking to me? She has been taking me for a ride. Maybe she thinks she's smart and I'm a fool. Let's see how it ends today. Because I'm going to take that which I have been paying for by force. Thank you. How are you? I'm good. Mm. I missed you. I missed you too. Mm. How are you? I came with a drink. What are we celebrating? Our love. And our togetherness. Okay. Yeah. So, get glasses so that we can drink. All right, I'll yeah. be right back. Thank you. What is he doing? Put it something in my drink. Jesus Christ.
Mm. <laughs> My baby. <laughs> right? This is for you. Thank Aha. you. For our love. For our togetherness. Yes. You've been the best part of me. I really love you, baby. Thank you for being there for me. Thank you for all you've done for me. Thank you for being my baby girl. It's okay. So drink. Drink. Mm -hmm. mm, nice drink. Oh, yeah. You want more? No. Let's get done with this first. <laughs> no, it's fine. Um, honey. Please go to the kitchen and get me some snacks. I want to blend with these to make a good combination. Okay. Anything for you, baby girl. I would do just that. Drink, drink. I have more for you I here. Know, I will. It's ah, nice should drink. I do more for you? No, no. I have to finish. Okay, let me get it. Wait, drink, drink, right? Okay. Oh, okay, right back. Hmm. What happened? Hmm? Why am I naked? You had so much fun sleeping with me. You finally had your way drunk. We had sex? Get rest and go home. Honey, good evening. Oh. This way you drop your clothes like this and your, your face is like this. Is everything all right? I'm tired. Tired? Yeah. Fred and I went to the man that promised to help us get a job. But the man... It's, he it's okay. Hmm? It's fine. I understand. It's fine. Have you had something to eat? Not really. I'm, I'm, I'm not feeling it. Why? I, I'm don't not happy. worry. Let me. Don't worry. Just eat and relax. I mean, you, you've tried your best now. There's really nothing else you can do. Oh, okay. Okay. Let me just drop and get you some food. Just relax, okay? What are you doing here? How did you find me? Which question do I answer first? Please, I'm not cut out for this. Can you tell me what are you doing here? And how did you find me? Lawrence, it's a small town. You cannot continue to hide forever. You thought I wouldn't know you were married? <sighs> nice apartment. Well done. What are you playing at? I'm not here to play, mister. I am pregnant for you. What? You're pregnant for who? No. I don't understand. 
How can you be pregnant? How can I not be pregnant? When you took advantage of me at my residence. Um. <coughs> no, no, you, 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 you cannot be pregnant. How can you be pregnant when I have a lovely wife in my life? Really? You have a lovely wife in your life, yet you spiked my drink and took advantage of me at my house. I can't recall all this. I can't. How can you not recall? Do you want to deny our born baby the paternity he or she deserves? Or would you want me to let your taxi driver wife know about our secret affairs? Or you want me to let her know that all the efforts we've been trying to put together to make sure your home is successful is abortive? Please take my wife out of this. I beg you. Then give me a better idea on how we can handle this issue. You suddenly lost your tongue. You can't talk. You'll terminate the baby. I will do no such thing. You will have to run these two beautiful families together. Else you will leave me with no choice than to move my things into your apartment. No way. I don't need you here, please. Okay? I'll take care of you and the baby. And your wife. You will have to take care of her. Neither of us will suffer because of your stupidity. And you will show me proof of your caring attitude towards her. Why are you doing this to me? Every woman deserves a loving and a caring spouse. Monica deserves it. I deserve it. We both deserve it. Do you want to shop? Ah, no. Thank you. Is this a human being or what? Does she think she's a cow? Who on this earth eats like this? Oh, Lord have mercy. What's up? No, no, no problem. I thought that much. You will provide me on a daily basis footages of your caring attitude towards your wife. My wife will ask questions. I've not been doing this with her before. Well, there's always a beginning. Let her know it's a new phase between you two. Make her understand that she deserves every bit of your love and care. I won't be the reason for a broken home, Lawrence. Don't dare me. Do not dare me. Stick to our agreement. Am I understood?
Madam, wait, wait, wait. Is this food you want to eat? Is it your business? How does it not consign me? Eh? You've been eating since now. At, at least, pity your heart. Eh? Pity your fragile heart. How does the way I eat consign you for this driving? It's my business. It's my business because eating like a gluten in the Bible is a sin. Since I carried you, you've eaten banana. You ate a family-sized loaf of bread. You ate um, what's the, you ate egg, ate granite. Use juice to wash it down, and now you want to eat rice on top of this one. That's bad now. At least pity yourself and your heart. It's not healthy. It's like it's like your head no collect. Eh? What? Eh? Why do you like putting mat for waiting another person's business? It's, if it's to put mat in this one, yes, let me put <laughs> mat in it. <laughs> see me, see wahala. I just dare dare order for this allied to take me to where I'm going to. You just dare here, they put mat for my business. I don't understand. Stop eating this food now. Eh? If you don't stop eating this food, I won't take you to wherever it is you're going to. I won't take you. Stop. Madam, please, do. Holly, holly, take me to where I'm going to. I beg. Now, now, party day start. I beg. Before I go miss my party jollof. You are going to eat jollof. But this one is still the same rice now. Um, sister, please, just come down from my car. <laughs> come down, come down from the car. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Stop. Come down. You don't jam. You won't collect, Abby. You won't collect. I say I'm not going again. Come and push me. I'm not going. To come down from my car Come now. and push me. Madam, you will take me to where I'm going to. You will take me to where I'm going to before I come down. I've already paid for it. Oh, yeah, madam. Please come down. I'm not coming down. Come down now. Madam, please take me to where I'm going to. There's no time. I say I don't want to carry you again. Is it by force? No, no, no. Eh? I want to reach where I'm going. I don't want to go again. Madam, please come down. You wound yourself because I'm not coming down to this counter. I wish you I'm going to. And I say I don't want to go again. That's eh? not our agreement. Our agreement is for you to take me to where I'm going to. You if it's your money, I can give you back your I don't need your money. Even though you add the money, I will not take it. I want to enter this vehicle and reach to where I'm going to. I say I don't want to go. <laughs> you never see this problem. Madam, <laughs> come down. Come down now. I'm not going anywhere. Damn. What kind of problem? Okay. No. Oh yes, I'm I'm very, very sorry. Eh? If I've offended you, sorry, ju just calm down. Mm -hmm. eh? Sorry, fine woman. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You can eat all the whole food you want, ju but just calm down. I don't want to carry. Yes, so they don't church or church or church. You will carry somebody. Instead of you to take the person where you are where the person is going to, you'll be talking, putting mad for person business. I, it's like something is speaking through you. Mm -hmm. It's something speak. Madam, calm down. First and foremost, you will cook for your wife and serve the meals with love before she walks in, just to make her feel good after her daily hustle. Neither will I subscribe to having an abortion. Lawrence, I must have footages of your love duties with your wife, else... Hi, my love, <laughs> my baby girl for life. <laughs> this one, the table is all set. What's going on? Welcome back, my love. What are we celebrating? Nothing. Nothing, and you cooked? You never cooked, though. I know, but uh, I decided to cook for my baby girl to say thank you for all you've been doing for me and for you being a wonderful woman. Wow. Now that's the sweet of you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I want to you. taste this food. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. So why are you making the video? Well, I, you know, I love documentaries. So I want to keep these for our kids, for them to see wow. daddy and mommy before their parents. This, well, let me go and freshen up, wash my hand there okay, for my Okay, okay, breakfast. Uh -huh. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. 
But no, I can't touch anything. Let me go freshen up and then wash my hands. It's pop. fine. It's wow. fine. All right. So um, I'm waiting for you, right? As a woman, I feel loved when cared for. Make her an English breakfast and serve her in bed. Wakey, wakey. Let her take a break from her daily hustle so that you can spend a good time with her at home. Breakfast in she bed. deserves that beautiful moment. Baby. Babe. Mm. Wake, 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 wake up. Right? Mm. Babe. Yes. Wake up. Yeah. This is. Yeah, breakfast. Right. You made breakfast. Oh yeah. Wow. Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oh my god, my face is still swollen. I just woke it's up. It's okay. Let the world mm -hmm. see this beautiful couple. Is a morning time. <laughs> mm. <laughs> mm. <laughs> oh yeah, so babe, mm. enjoy wow. your breakfast. It made me breakfast. Yeah, enjoy it. Let me quickly eat all the time so I can get ready and leave. Yeah. No, you're not going anywhere today. Hmm? Yeah. I'm not going to work today. No, I didn't want you to go to work today. I want to spend quality time with my wife. <laughs> I don't understand this love. Oh. Mm? Mm. Mm. Wow. Mm. <laughs> mm. <laughs> mm. <laughs> mm. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Let's get rid of the baby. I cannot run. Two families. Really? But you can run one and a half. Listen. We are having this baby. You would run our home and that of your matrimonial home with love. I cannot. Get Monica a flower bouquet on your way home. Don't tell me. Do not tell me what to do. Did you just yell at me? I'm sorry. Listen, Lawrence. You do not know who you're dealing with. You will get your wife, Monica, a flower bouquet and gifts. You will present these gifts to her with romantic vocal appreciation for everything she has done. And you will have to send me the footage. One more thing, baby. If you want me to get rid of this baby, you have to show her lots of love. She has to feel loved. And you will give me the evidence of everything.
My baby, my sweetheart. This one you are kneeling down with flower. Who is punishing you? I love you so much, baby. I cannot think of a better way to spend my life without you in it. You are the best thing that has happened to me. You are my life. You are my treasure. And you are my everything. I really love you. I love you too. For me. Yes. This is my way of expressing my love for you. <laughs> Flower. <laughs> what am I going to do with flour? <laughs> Come on, baby. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. yeah. I know you like it. Yours! <laughs> I'm going for fellowship today. Don't do this thing. Wait, 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 wait. wait. <laughs> What's wrong with this phone? So this phone didn't record. Huh? Huh? What evidence would I then give to Sarafina? What, 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 is, what is all this now? Hey, I have to do this again now. Babe! 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 Then you have to make another video. But unfortunately, my phone could not record it. Why do I have to go back to it again? You have to do it over and over again. Because love is a virtue that refreshes and renews its genuine feelings tirelessly. This is of a rain. I cannot take it. Eh? I'm done with this. I'm tired of this. Stop it now. Stop it. What is all this? Stop it. Lawrence, love is what keeps the heart alive. If you don't have it, you end up destroying yourself. You need love to run the two families. I don't need two families. I do not need two families. Leave me alone. So tired. Are you okay? Uh, yeah. How did it go? Mm, it was God. fruitful, right? Of course, no. Thank God. Right. I'm fine. I'm just, uh, just tired. Tired. Mm. 
What did you do all day that you're tired? Um, nothing serious. I, I didn't do anything much. Then why are you tired? What's the little you did that's making you tired? Um, uh, babe, hmm? you need to go freshen up, hmm? Please. We'll see if you see this stuff. No problem. I'm tired. Maybe. Nothing really. The little thing. Nothing happened. Nothing much. Nothing. Then the little one that happened. It's okay. Nothing happened. What is it? Why are you awake? And why are you calling me by this time? Good men use the early hours of the morning to pray for the women in their lives. I don't get it. Are you alright? Say a word of prayer for your wife and your expectant baby mama with love and forward the footage to me as soon as possible. Are you sure you're okay? You will find out only when I don't get the footage of the prayer for your wife. <laughs> Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, I pray for my wife. Hi, increase on every side. God's protection on every side. In the name of Jesus Christ, I pray for you. As you sleep, you will sleep in peace. As you wake up, you will wake up in peace. Nobody will stop you. Nothing will stop you. Are you Monica? You don't you're dressed like this. Are you going to a club or a chalet? What kind of a stupid question is that? Imagine. <laughs> Ordinary taxi driver asking me a question. Madam, are you going or not? <laughs> uh, let's go. No, sorry. And um, go to the back. You've been ignoring my calls. You shouldn't be calling me in the middle of the night. My wife was at home. So? I was calling for a good cause. After all, your wife and I now share the same asset, which is you. I belong to just one woman, and her name is Monica, my wife. Please, terminate these fetters so that I can have peace, I beg you. So killing an unborn child will bring you peace? Monica, don't play that card. I am tired. I'm fed up in this. 
Can you terminate this pregnancy? I beg you. I cannot afford to take care of you and the baby. I am begging. Please. The torture is too much on me. Can't you see? Can't you see that? I'm begging you. Please. <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny. Um, sister, can I ask you a question? What? Don't you have shame? Shame about what? The way you're dressed. I mean, look at the young girl like you. I am comfortable in my skin. You're comfortable in your skin. Huh. Hmm? You're naked. You're not wearing bra. Your back is open. And you said you're comfortable in your skin. How can you be comfortable by being naked? Oh, Joman, can you just face your front and take me to my destination? Okay. I'm only trying to let you know that heaven is real and hell is also real. It's left to you to repent now, accept Jesus, be decent in your dressing, just so you can avoid eternal damnation. That's all. And who the hell are you, Deputy Jesus? Can you just concentrate on your driving and take me to my destination? Peter, keep your gospel to yourself. Okay, we're at your destination. I can see we're here. I'm trying to call my host to come out to pay your money. I don't I don't understand. Who is to pay me? Please calm down. He's going to pay you. <laughs> so your voice can be this calm. I was trying to advise you now. You were raising your voice. Now it's time to pay me my money. You're saying keep calm. Please pay me my money. Time is money, please. I don't have any money with me here. He's the one to pay. How will you not have any money with you? You don't have money and you came to enter cab? Please calm down first. Calm down. Now, madam, calm, calm down. down. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Madam, I will pay your money. You will pay me the money from where? I'm trying to call my host. He's want to pay you your money. You calm are calling down, your host. You didn't call your host before I carried you. He's now you want to call your host. Please give me my money. Give me, give me my money. Look Madam, at you. Down, Look at please. you. Look at. Look at. You are naked, completely naked. If I hold you now, your breath will be outside everywhere. You say you're comfortable in your skin. Which rubbish skin? Give me my money. Give me my money. Don't waste my time. Don't waste my time, you this little girl. Madam, don't waste my time. Madam, calm down. I don't have any money with me. My host is supposed to pay you. I'm trying to you don't... shame. Hey, Madam, you're embarrassing me. What is all this? Eh? Come, Bampada. Come, Bampada. Where are you going to? See, young lady, just give me my money. You see, I didn't say anything to you when I carried you. Just give me my money. Let me go. Give me my money. Madam, calm down. I'm trying to call my host. He will be the one to pay you. I don't have any money. And I don't even know the exact house he's staying. You don't know the exact house he's staying. So your own is prostitution. Eh? Ha! Your case is finished. Your case is finished. The temple of God, you're using it anyhow. No fear, no shame. Eh? Give me. Give! What are you embarrassing me now? Lord. You're embarrassing me. Look at this. Holy Sepulchre. Eh? 
inside is rotting. Look at your hair. You are covering it. Can you give me my money? Oh, calm down. Let me call him. Is it this person that just came out? You don't think? Please give me my money. You, do, you don't even know who you're looking for. Eh? What exactly is wrong with this generation? What? You left your house. You came to look for somebody you don't know. Is that how you people are? Do you have a mother? You have a mother. And she trained you like this. Eh? You see, that's the problem. I don't even know if I'm to blame you or I'm to blame your parents. Because the Bible says, raise up a child in the way he or her should grow. So that when they grow, they will not depart. So I'm sure your mother has not been training you in the path you're supposed to go. Or she trained you in this path too. Eh? Give me this phone. Ha. What kind of... Okay. An iPhone. You, you, so I will keep this one to myself. No, you can't until go my, I cannot go... But you, you can go with my money. Well, don't come down. He will come out. He will pay your money. He will come out. He will pay... Since we've been talking here, he's still not coming out. Eh? Should I just do this? Honey, what is it? I'm fine, you're back. No, you cannot be fine. I cannot be fine like this. What's going on? Hmm? It's my jobless situation. I'm tired of all this, baby. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm losing my mind. No, you cannot lose your mind. You can't. Eh? I don't really know what to do again. I'm confused. I'm tired of this country. I think the best thing for me to do now is to go to Ghana and try there. Maybe I will find something doing. I have friends there. They said I should come. Find one or two and fix myself. Um, well, if going to Ghana is going to make you not to lose your mind, I think it's fine. You can go. It's not a problem. Hmm? Really? Yes, now. If that's going to make you be fine. At least you can just go meet your friends and see what they can help you with. Hmm? Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Because they say you can go to Ghana. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Are Thank you. Is there something else? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Wait. <laughs> because Thank you're going to Ghana. Thank you. Thank you. Hello? Hello?
Exacto. Yo no lo hice. Yo no lo hice con el teléfono. ¿Eh? Es solo un código. Maybe it's a wrong number. Maybe it's the person died the wrong number. I don't say I don't have this. I don't know the person. I don't even know this number. Okay. Huh? Oh, I'm so Is there any problem? Did I say there was one? No, the way you're you're sounding, I, I don't know. No. What's the time? Say the time now. 5 a.m. I have to go get ready for the day. Are you sure everything is alright? Oh. I think they're telling me something is wrong. <laughs> Honey, oh, I'm leaving now. Honey! I hope yeah. I have my Okay. Hmm? You're set to go. Yes, sir. I'm leaving. Alright. I pray that the good Lord will perfect you. Amen. May your day be fruitful. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. What's that? I'm checking. Check here. Shaking inside the But that's fine. See it, man? Oh. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, babe, um, hmm? please do not forget what we discussed. Oh, the money. The Ghana movement. No problem. I will go to the bank now, or I will go later after, maybe a few. It's better I go now, don't worry. Uh, so that people will not be much when I'm ready to. Thank you so much. I trust my wife. Before people will be much. I trust my baby. Stay well, then. Give me a high five. High five, high five. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good luck. Thank you. Bye. What is wrong with you? You think everything is about money? How much is money compared to life itself? Please. I don't want us to argue this. Take the money and stay away from my family and I. Please. You want your wife to be aware of what is going on? I don't care anymore. You heard me loud and clear. I do not care. You can go ahead and tell her if you want. You can go ahead and do whatever nonsense you want to do with the baby. I'm no longer interested. I'm tired of all this nonsense. I'm tired of being pushed to the wall as if I'm a baby. I am tired. Go ahead and do whatever nonsense you want to do. I am no longer interested. I'm no longer interested. You're pushing me. I'm a man. You're pushing me as if I'm a woman. I'm tired of being controlled by a woman. I'm tired. Go ahead and do whatever nonsense you want to do. I'm tired about it. I was reminiscing on the past when things were awesome for us. I didn't have to work this this much. I was a man taking care of my home, footing bills on my own, making sure that things were right. But uh, It's well. A few days to the weekend, and by weekend, oh, you know, it will be two years, you know. It's way too. Here I walk. Eh? How could I even forget that it's our anniversary? Here I Well, it's you. Weekend. Right? No matter what happens. I will always love you. Thank you so much for all you have done and you're still doing for me. 
Any beauty. I love you. So, so much. I love you no matter what. I will always be here for you. I will always take care of you. I will always remember all that you have done for me. Thank you so much for everything. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Open your eyes up. Open your eyes. Yeah. Open your eyes. Just go. 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 One step. Go. More. 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 To here. Aha. You can open your eyes now. plan and arrange all this? Well, uh, a few hours ago. I planned it and arranged it myself for you. Because you deserve better, Monica. Yeah. Every day, I love to love you more. You will always be my joy, my treasure, and my heart. Today, tomorrow, and forever. I really love you. So you can do this for me? So you can do all of this for me. How do you mean? You needed a woman to teach you how to love your wife. A woman? Which woman are you talking about? Serafina, your girlfriend. Oh. Are you surprised? Babe, let me explain to you, please. Babe, can I talk to you? Please. I invited her here because I think it's time to unveil the truth. So you've been in touch with my wife? For how long? For how long? We've known each other for a while now. She saw us working together on the road some time ago. 
She trailed me to my house. Into these gates? Yes. Oh, okay. And so I hope you have seen me the alert. Oh, sorry, though. Okay, okay. Bye. All right. Okay, thank you. Yeah. Uh. Foolish man. He wants to sleep with Serafina. Me. Never. He will never see my pants. I will continue to milk him of his money. He thinks I'm sick. Story for the gods. I'm not expecting anyone. Who could that be? Could it be Lawrence? Hello, who are you? Can I call me? I don't know who you are. My name is Monica. And I am Lawrence's wife. Oh my goodness. I'm really broken. I don't even know how to. I don't have the strength to face him at home. I'm sorry. I'm only flirting. I mean no harm. Flirting with someone's husband would definitely cause damage to the spouse. You, you're the reason my husband doesn't touch me. No. Yes. You're the reason my husband does not act romantically towards me. You're the reason he doesn't want to have kids with me. Because he wants to have kids with you. No. Not at all. Look. I'm not that kind of person. I can never do a thing like that. I don't desire to be a baby mama to a married man. But you desire to sleep with a married man? No. I haven't slept with him. I'm just having fun. Having fun? You're having fun with my husband? I just got to know about that now. I never knew he was married. I work so hard. I work so, so hard to make us happy. I work so hard to put food on our table because I love my husband with my whole being. I 
I told you because I want to plead with you. Please. Please leave my husband alone. I love that man so much. I love him so, so much. <laughs> That's the reason I'm here. I love him. And I loved the home. I envisioned for us before I said I do. Please, I beg you. I'm deeply sorry. From the bottom of my heart, I am sorry. Please put yourself together. Please. I'm sorry. I never knew you was married. I'm also a woman like you and I wouldn't want to destroy another woman's home. <sighs> Fine. I know what to do. Please don't don't let go of him as a partner. Please. I will make him make things right with you. He will make things right with you. Baby, I'm so sorry. I'm genuinely sorry. Find a place in your heart and forgive me. Please. The process. This whole setup is a genuine approach to a new beginning. I've messed up. I know. But I've... I own up to my mistakes. I'm so sorry. Forgive me, please. I promise you that I will never, ever cheat on you again. Please forgive me. I'm genuinely sorry. Please, forgive me. Forgive me. Please. Please. I really forgive you. Yes. Because I really, really love you. I love you too. I love you so much. I'm sorry. I was never pregnant. We never made love. I saw you via my CCTV camera when you spiked my drink. So I exchanged it to save myself from your evil acts. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry.